Good morning. I'm Aqua Cephas and I welcome you all to my channel. Hope everyone is doing well. Today we will be talking about John Garangdi Mabir. John Garangdi Mabir was born on the 23rd of June 1945 and died on the 30th of July 2005. He was a Sudanese politician and revolutionary leader. From 1983 to 2005, he led a Sudan People's Liberation Army the Second Sudanese Civil War, and following a peace agreement, he briefly served as first vice president of Sudan for three weeks until his death in a helicopter crash on 30 July 2005. A developmental economist by profession, Garang was a major influence on the movement that led to the foundation of South Sudan. Garang who is regarded as the founding father and symbol of unity in today's South Sudan is a member of the Dinka ethnic group. He was born into a poor family in Wingali village Twik East County in the Upper Nile region of Sudan. An orphan by the age of 10, he had his fees for school paid by a relative, going to schools in Wan and Rumbik. In 1962 he joined the first Sudanese civil war, but because he was so young, the leaders encouraged him and others his age to seek an education. Because of the ongoing fighting, Garang was forced to complete his secondary education in Tanzania. After winning a scholarship, he went on to earn a Bachelor of Arts degree in Economics in 1969 from Grinnell College in Iowa, United States. He was offered another scholarship to pursue graduate studies at the University of California, Berkeley, but chose to return to Tanzania and study East African Agricultural Economics as a Thomas J. Watson Fellow at the University of Dar es Salaam, Udzum. At Udzum, he was a member of the University Students' African Revolutionary Front. However, Garang soon decided to return to Sudan and join the rebels. There is much erroneous reporting that Garang met and befriended Yauri Museveni, future president of Uganda, at this time. While both Garang and Museveni were students at Udzum in the 1960s, they did not attend at the same time. In 1970, Garang was in one of the batches of Gordon Maurat Mayan soldiers, the then leader of the Nyanu Liberation Movement, sent to Israel for military training. The civil war ended. With the Addis Ababa Agreement of 1972 and Garang, like many rebels, was absorbed into the Sudanese military. For 11 years, he was a career soldier and rose from the rank of captain to colonel after taking the infantry officer's advanced course at Fort Benning, Georgia, United States. During this period he took four years academic leave and received a master's degree in agricultural economics from Iowa State University, ISU. Citation needed in 1981, he earned a PhD in economics from Iowa State University, ISU. By 1983, Colonel Garang was serving as a senior instructor in the military academy in Wadi Saidma 21 kilometers from the center of Omdurman, where he instructed the cadets for more than four years. Later he was nominated to serve in the military research department at Army HQ in Khartoum. Garang coined the philosophy of Sudanism, which would be the guiding philosophy to a secular and multi-ethnic new Sudan. He believed, for the people of Sudan to live in cohesion, they must not separate themselves into the many existing ethnic factions present within the nation but, rather, to collectively renounce the belief that Arabness, Black Africanness, Islam or Christianity were to be the ultimate defining characteristics of Sudan. Rather, he willed that citizens should embrace all cultures of Sudan, and to unify under the one commonality they all share, being Sudanese. I hope you enjoyed this video. Kindly let me know in the comments section. Don't forget to subscribe. Thanks.